Hello and welcome to the Dashboard Builder. My name is Chris. In this video, I am going to show you how to create a chart in Laravel using the Dashboard Builder without programming. Before we begin, let's go over the prerequisites. The Dashboard Builder can be installed any platforms like Windows, Linux, Mac and Ubuntu or any other platform support Apache. Laravel 9 or a later version is installed, up and running on your server. PHP version 7.2 or later version is installed and up and running on an Apache server. Create a folder name Dashboard. Download the Dashboard Builder from dashboardbuilder.net and copy the zip in it. Unzip the file. Now open the browser and access the browser through URL. This is the welcome screen close it as we don't want take a tour. First and foremost, we must choose a dashboard theme. Then, select a theme. I'll be using the fall fire theme, so click on it. Press the apply button. Now, in the following step, I will connect to our MySQL database and retrieve the data from it. Select the database icon. Select the MySQL database. Enter the URL of your host server. Enter database user. Enter password. Here, enter your database name. Now click the connect button. Click the OK button. This green tick shows that your database is connected. Double click the Navi bar to open chart settings panel. I am going to use bar chart for the my chart. Ship date will go to the X axis. And unit price will go to the Y axis. Add one more trace. Select bar chart. Ship date to X axis. And unit cost will go to the Y axis. Click Save Changes button to save your chart. Adjust the size of the panel. Now I'm going to add a donut chart. Double click the bar to access the chart setting panel. Click the donut chart. Select unit sold to X axis. Select region to Y axis as we want chart to show region wise units sold. Enter a legend. Region's name or getting started appeared. Select the show label option. Labels are beginning to appear. Save your changes by clicking the save button. Change the size and position. Now I'm going to add line chart. Select line chart option. Select order date to X axis. Unit sold will go to the Y axis. On the next trace, select order date to X axis and unit cost to Y axis. Expand the analytics bar and click the ascending order. Adjust the size and position. And finally I'm going to add a histogram chart. Double click the bar. Select the histogram chart. Region will go to X axis. Select total profit for Y axis as I want to see the region Y's profit. Hit the save changes button. Adjust the size. So we've finished our dashboard. Save the dashboard because we can't create a Laravel package without it. I'm going to name our dashboard sales. Press the save button. The sales dashboard has been saved. Now click the view button to see the dashboard preview. To create a Laravel package navigate to publish and then select Laravel code. Here you have it. Our Laravel package has been created and is ready for download. Click the download Laravel code button to get your Laravel package. Place the package file in the Laravel site's vendor folder. Extract the zip file to the sales dashboard folder. The package file has now been extracted and placed in the folder. Now go to the resources folder. Click the Views folder. Copy and paste this line to welcomeblade.php under Resources folder. Scroll down paste the code beneath the body. Scroll down and copy and paste the chart code. Copy and paste the following chart code here. The array represents your chart number, where 0 represents your first chart. One represents your second, and so on. Save the welcome.blade file.
Now go to the Laravel site. Here you have it. Our dashboard is now available. Line, histograms, bar and donut charts are displayed. That's all I have for now. I hope this was informative, and thank you for watching. Please follow our channel to be notified of new videos and tutorials.